And the last game is gonna be against Gerald 35 If the game goes long, it's gonna be a problem against this hero. But we're uh, right here. We have, we have the Infernal of all shit. It's good. It's good. It's a good start. Don't have the... Not as good maybe as the, as, as the Wisdom Shrine and New Horizons. But it's good. Because we can mill right away. It's just top. Ah, fuck. We milled a reanimate, but we got an Elder Red Dragon in there. So, if we're a little bit lucky, we might. <laughs> Fucking hate these headphones. We might get an early uh, dragon on the field. Gonna see about that. And I was. First, I thought um, that it's actually. That's not a problem. Just throw all your removal at the ones that don't matter as much. Be my guest. At first, I thought uh, it's gonna be uh, vampire vampires, but apparently not. It's wisdom, dominion. At least it's um. At least Gadador's bitching got nerfed. So that's a good thing. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get the dragon out and see if he removes it instantly. But yet, as long as the if the game goes long, this tempting lure is gonna bite us in the ass because we have really strong creatures in our in our deck. Obviously, we only have strong creatures, so he's gonna shrink it. I think by touching him vampirically wouldn't surprise me. We're down to a four four. Would be interesting if it also would slow creatures down. Oh, okay. He's not fucking around. Mm. Not really want to, what I want to see. Let's just throw this at it. Mm, not a problem. New horizons. Not as not not necessarily needed, but we might get. The additional wisdom level for Eleanor. Scatador. Oh, sc oh, Scatadors. And we have good cards, you know. It's uh, it's uh, it'll be interesting to see how that goes. Because I haven't seen it being played yet. Let's see. Oh, that's his. Oh yeah, that's, all, ah, that's also our cr Fuck you, dude. <laughs> it's also our creatures. What the hell? Oh yeah, and he has wisdom left. Fuck it. <laughs> I hate that. Why, Nigel? Why? You don't have to do this. <laughs> Interesting to see how that works, though. Can we also activate that, though? I would get. I would love to get that blood well mat matriarch, actually. Let's nail him a little bit. Could play another one, but I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna use uh, Power Discharge for that. Just to get rid of it. Extra card draw. You know, it's good. It's good stuff. Oh, there is an Entry L. And I think we also milled a Reanimate, yeah. Which sucks a little bit, sure. Get that back, and get Eleanor back, and leave Brittany alone. What you got? P fucking power discharge. So he only has to pay the mana, I guess. That's kind of shitty. For us. <laughs> Yeah, we kind of need an airship now. I need to get stuff in in, in the graveyard. And, nah, well, that's not necessarily. I definitely need the, need the um, what should I call it? I definitely need to get reanimate. However, I don't think we're gonna win this because of exactly that. Bloodwell, annoying as matriarch. Who's gonna use our spells against against us? I 
That's a start. Just gonna throw this at him. Sadly, it doesn't redraw itself. Sucks. But shuffles everything a little bit. Two power discharge. You, you freaking... How you call that? Stealer? Level 2. He can also get reanimate, though. Doesn't have anything frightening in there, though. But he would probably get Black Bloodwell Matriarchs back. I think. Well, we can make him sack one with Bessie. Which we don't have in the graveyard, sadly. Or do we? Nope. Come on, airship. Come on, airship. Airship! <laughs> Alright then. Get this in the graveyard. I think I'm gonna kill off one of these because they are freaking annoying. There you go. It's one dealt with. Um, bum, 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 yes. Cataclysm. That sucks, actually. When I get, like, one good creature on the board, you can just use this. <laughs> Bullshit! <laughs> and now I can't run this into him, you freaking bastard. Just the worst. Now for, like, free value. You suck! <laughs> then again, well, you know, the last guy actually also had a, um, had a silver ticket, so I wasn't too sure if we could actually make it. This guy, however, has one and plays an annoying deck, so... He definitely has the better... the better, uh, option to win. Now, by the way... I think... And that happens rarely... Um, if I get rid of the Elder and reanimate him, I think that would be better at this point. Because if I go for Bezzy, he's just maybe going to get rid of this. And I think... Am I going to have enough? Yeah, I'm going to have enough to... Yeah. I'm gonna have have enough for um for the dragon breath right here. Sure. So let's get the show on the roll, shall we? Let's get rid of this garbage right here. <laughs> nobody needs that. Ain't nobody got time for that. He's probably gonna get cataclysm though. Oh, he didn't. Oh, and I can actually snatch that away. I just... Hmm. True. I can also get that Eleanor, actually. Because it's during each player's turn. The fuck is wrong with you and your freaking... <laughs> what? Oh, well, that's, uh, that's annoying. Was a good play, but it's still annoying. It's still shit. <laughs> I think I might play... I think I might play another dragon and just go face. 6, 9, damn, you're fine. Looking at 11 damage, however. Huh. We'll be down to three mana. Oh, no, wait, I wouldn't, because I can just use... Yeah, sure. 
Or do I get Entriella? Nah, I get the dragon. Because this. Mm, get a card draw. Dual barrel roll. Alright. We are not at the worst position yet. Now we are. <laughs> fucking blood seeking mutants, though. That's kind of hilarious, I gotta say. <laughs> Sadly, I don't have Dominion Shrines because I could have used Cataclysm against this annoying ass. <laughs> Those blood seeking mutants, though, honestly, I kind of like that. <laughs> I don't mind losing against that. That is fun. That is actually fun. Like, you know, getting like two blessing mutants out and then just wipe the creature to give them all like might emblems. <laughs> that's 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 nice. I like that. Ah, what I what would I give for two obelisks? <laughs> ah, damn it. <clears throat> I don't think airships would do much though. Yeah, give me one of, give me, give me a Karthus. <laughs> or what? Are, he's, he's, um, I, I can kind of see him giving us something there. Okay, I, admittedly, it would be pretty uh, BM, I think, if he would have just given us a Karthus. Holding on to dear life, let's see. Well, you know, I can I can still get it, I mean <laughs> at least. Uh but yeah, that's lost, but gotta say, that was an interesting game. That was an uh, that I didn't you don't get on end on the naughty list, Gerald, because that was that was genuinely fun, I gotta say. Uh, because you know, we, you know, we didn't get hit with like uh, fucking removal all the damn time, so that yeah, was well, was refreshing. Uh, but yeah, that was uh, Darius Reanimator. Didn't go as well because uh, Metal Zoa wants annoying ass OTH deck, but apparently everyone that plays ladder um, just knows one type. Nah, not the last guy and not the second guy, but most of the guys uh, just know uh, annoying bullshit decks. So there is that. By the way, um, we ran in with the Heal Million episode, we ran into that um, Jin deck uh, that used also Thomic Thom Thom Reflector. Uh, definitely gonna, gonna attempt to make a deck like that as well, because it sounds pretty interesting actually. To get like the Jin Battle Mage, I think it was, the one that um, gets health damage, receives health damage and does double damage. Uh, with Thomic Reflector or just like with uh, Order... Spells like um, Angelic Touch, I think it was. Uh, could be pretty pretty OP. And I'm going to attempt to actually recreate that deck. And then we're going to see how that fares. But for this one, I got to say, um, being ranked, it actually did quite well. Um, obviously, like, uh, it's... And I, I really like, uh, I really like uh, the new Skedador, got to say. Like, maybe he forgot to put it... Maybe he genuinely forgot to get it out of the deck. Might be a thing, but the fact that actually each player, uh, that that both players, sorry, can actually just like get the uh, get an opponent's card and play it, is pretty cool. Like you can also just snatch as you could as you, as you saw, you could also just snatch like a cataclysm. And you know, as I said, like it would be cool if we would actually have splashed in some dominion levels or just got two obelisks out and just change our two aspects, snatch that um, cataclysm and hit him with that because. Would have been pretty hard to recover from that. But that was it for uh, spell this uh, episode of Spellware Ranked. We continue to tumble down even further. We are now, or still, at a rating of 968 and uh, ranked 258. So not even uh, relevant anymore. Not in the top 200. So we suck at the moment. Uh, yeah, thanks to, by the way, again. Um, no, I'm not going to name them because they don't deserve it. But thanks to Rage, Wisdom and One Turn Heal. But that being said... That was it for, um, that was it from the Salt Factory, and I'll see you in the next Spellweaver-related video.
hopefully with against less annoying piece of garbage tr uh, trash decks.